Hello this is PCBI.com thanks for watching this video. Epoxy filled vias technology is very popular in manufacturing boards of multi-layer and large thickness. We use epoxy filled vias to solve all the problems that plugged vias can't solve. It will be different though processing epoxy filled vias under different circumstances. Let's see the difference between epoxy filled vias and plugged vias. By comparing, you would find the vias are totally filled by epoxy and it will improve many problems caused by plugged vias processed such as shrinkage of ink in vias, vias are not fulfilled, etc. Epoxy filled vias process can also plate copper and trace on the surface of plugged vias to increase the line density. Looking to the tracing requirements, epoxy filled vias is a better choice on acid and alkali resistant than plugged vias. Epoxy filled vias is divided into silk screen machine filled and vacuum filled and the productive result is marked difference. Silk screen machine filled vias is using the normal silk screen machine to fill epoxy into holes on metal substrate. Then do baking, curing and remove excessive glued and complete the process for finished filled vias. Epoxy lost during baking will need a layer of high temperature protective film on the back to support the epoxy and drill several air hole to vent during plug via. Vacuum fill via to fill the epoxy into the holes in metal substrate in vacuum environment with vacuum fill via machine then do baking. Curing and remove excessive glue and complete the process for finished filled via epoxy loss during baking will need a layer of high temperature protective film on the back to support the epoxy. Silk screen filled via machine is easy to cause the bubble around holes, hole is not full and etc. Fullness of vacuum filled via can be up to more than 95%. To avoid the rough pee, the of sunk via and missed empty vias are sure the conductance requirements this is why PCB by use vacuum filled via this is the slice of a 2 mm thickness board produced by PCB with 0.2 hole size of epoxy filled vias with copper clad on hole. Epoxy filled vias are very full and the lowest hole copper is more than 1 atom and the surface copper thickness of finished product is 51 um. Copper clad of hole is 29 all the indicators meet or even exceed the industry standard let's focus on copper clad on hole because the epoxy and copper are easily in delamination. In response to this question we found that when the copper thickness on the hole is more than 1 5 um, the delamination of epoxy and copper can be greatly improved and we can avoid delamination when reaches to 9 in order to ensure the effect of epoxy filled vias there are more tips for example when removing the excessive glue to use the ceramic imitation process to avoid the functional concerns of hump of epoxy and lack of copper. On hold after the process is completed, we will process the AOI inspection to ensure the quality before lead time. Thanks for watching. See you next time.